So you heard of what your Republican kind of counterpart had to say. Uh, there's no need for the moderator, in this case Lester Holt, to, to play a fact checker. What do you make of that? Sean's a good guy. He's a, he's a good friend of mine. But it seems as though Republicans are allergic to fact checking. And they should be because they've got a candidate who repeatedly lies about his own positions and other people's positions. I mean, remember during the primary, he claimed that, uh, or uh, he, uh, he insinuated that Ted Cruz's dad was. Uh, part of the Kennedy assassination. He, he talked about Ted Cruz not being uh, qualified to be president because of his potential citizenship issues. So why so, can't you know, Hillary Clinton be, why can't Hillary Clinton then be the one to correct him on, on those if that's the case? Why well, should I it be up to Lester Holt? I fully anticipate that Secretary Clinton will call out the various times when, uh, when Donald Trump has fun with, the, with facts. But look, here's the real issue. Uh, who's going to lay out the And the same should detail? apply to Hil uh, just to be clear, the same Absolutely. should apply to Hillary Clinton if she exaggerates some points. I think if a moderator, look, if it's a moderator of the media, I think if someone tells something that's not true, they should be held to account for that. And just because Donald Trump makes a routine of lying about his positions and, and Secretary Clinton's positions doesn't mean he should get a pass. But look, let me just say that this is about who's going to lay out a detailed, coherent policy to make us stronger in the world, to make the economy work for all of us, and, and to bring us together. Uh, Secretary Clinton has done that, and uh, Donald Trump hasn't. He should be held to the same standard as Secretary Clinton.